What is up my ninjas, Dark Frog Ninja here. Today is Friday, but unfortunately there is no new Dark Discussion. I'm going to probably be putting the Dark Discussion on a mid-season break. As uh, I had plans, I thought I'd have my biopod by now, and uh, I was going to do setup videos and each different discussion was going to be different parts of it. Uh, I was going to do a plant video about tropical plants, what I have, uh, what I'm putting in the new biopod, and uh, what I recommend. Uh, there's gonna be a whole bunch of stuff I was gonna do, but unfortunately Biopod isn't here. Um, who knows when that's gonna get here. So, uh, you know, I'm gonna go on a dark discussion break. Like I said, a mid-season break for now, and uh, I'll be back with that stuff. So just today, I'm just gonna kinda show off some of the frogs here. Constantine sitting there. I don't know where Zed is. She might be inside the log. Oh, nope, there she is. Let's see if I can get her. Yeah, she's right on the log. Like I said, they like to climb. And she's right there. You can see her right in center frame. Right there is her head. They like to climb on that. It hasn't missed it yet. It's going to soon. So there's that. Um, what else? We got some isopods, the giant gray. I said they are going nuts in here they really enjoy uh, today's feeding day for everything so they're they know that they know the drill and then uh, my springtails I got some nice white mold growing there um, unfortunately there are some mites still in here um, but I've been battling that and uh, they're grain mites um, so they're not harmful towards my frogs or anything else they just like eating the grain they don't like the uh, moisture as much so I'm gonna probably flood this out and see what happens see if I can get rid of them that way because I don't want to trash the whole thing because there's a lot of springtails in here still um, they don't like a top open so they're, they bury down because they like the closed humidity they don't like me moving around so there's not too many springtails out to see and then finally we have my uh, quarantine tank with the two phyllobates in here my mints that I picked up this week uh, they fed uh, the first day I got them, and then I've tried to feed them a little bit almost every day um, because they are not adults yet. These guys are probably sub-adults still. They're a lot smaller than I thought they were going to be, but uh, that's okay. I had a glass panel on on the top to kind of help seal in humidity, but I think the reflection on the light was causing this one to continually look up and jump and bang our head on the top. So I've since replaced that. I have a little uh, ghetto plastic wrap. Uh, I did leave a strip of ventilation in the middle all the way to the back. So there is a ventilation, but this is helps with the humidity. And then she stopped jumping up and bumping her head on the top, which is great. Um, they've been very active. Uh, this one in particular is fearless. I've been, I was trying to feed them different food items so far. They eat the high day fruit flies and they also uh like the phoenix worms so that's good i got to eat that today's cricket day um i'm gonna see hopefully they have the right size crickets i'm gonna try crickets out on them see if they like that but uh, they're doing well um they won't be added until may 17th but that's it um really for today uh there's my fruit flies and some bean beetle cultures i have going as well nothing too spectacular down there just just uh food for the frogs but uh, there you have it. That's it for the day, guys. Uh, I'm, I'll give you, still give you update videos um, weekly, updates on these guys, updates on uh, Constantine Z, the Biopod, everything like that, any new developments. But as far as the dark discussion goes, it again is going on a mid-season break. So, and then I will be back with that when I have the content that I want to put out for that. So that's it, guys. This is Dark Frog Ninja saying, Frog on.